brink of extinction, the southern white rhino sports one of the largest horns in the animal kingdom. When it comes to defending territory, rhinos usually just push and shove. Serious injuries are rare. But when there's a female to fight for, things can get savage. We came around a very wide bend, and there, right before our eyes, were these two rhino absolutely locked in battle. Tracy and Chris Jacobs were on holiday in Etosha National Park, Namibia, when they found they were centre stage for a clash of the titans. It was instant excitement. Chris just slammed on brakes. He didn't want to go another inch further forward because they were clearly very aggressive and he was afraid they were going to ram the vehicle. And I was shouting him, never mind the vehicle, I just go forward, I've got to get this footage. So half hanging out the window, we inched forward until eventually we were as close as we did. One of the rhinos has an extraordinarily long horn, but its size seems to hamper him, not help. The shorter horned challenger definitely has the edge. The one appeared to be stronger and fitter than the other one, and far more aggressive. The weaker of the two would keep turning around and trying to run away, and the more aggressive rhino would run up behind him and literally lift him right off the ground with his horn. It's amazing to think that he was lifting up 3,000 kilograms, and he did it so easily. That's three tons, the weight of a large SUV, on the tip of a horn made of keratin, the same substance as our fingernails. The rear end of the victim was very punctured and, and bleeding from the amount of times he'd been rammed. Extreme aggression like this is rare in rhinos, and is almost always caused by the presence of a female ready to mate. Usually, rhino fights end when an opponent retreats, but the shorthorn challenger wants to make sure victory is his. Sadly, in this case, surrender isn't an option. It was terribly sad. It was a very sad thing to see, but at the same time, also very exciting, because you know you're getting footage that is very rarely seen. <laughs>